On the downstroke, the priming piston at the bottom of the pump moves down into the lower pump cylinder, creating a low pressure area. As the priming piston clears the slots at the bottom of the pump, grease is pushed into the low pressure area with a follow plate inductor or ram. The follow plate inductor or ram applies a force to the container of grease to prime the pump. This animation shows the use of a follow plate. After the downstroke, the grease is located between the priming piston and foot valve packing retainer. The packing retainer is located near the letter A in the animation. On the upstroke, the grease just loaded during the priming stage is forced through the holes near the closed lower check valve. This action traps the fluid between the foot valve packing retainer and lower ball check. On the next downstroke, the lower check closes and the upper check opens. As the pump piston moves down, the grease transfers past the upper check. Since the piston is half the size of the cylinder, half of the grease is pumped on this downstroke. At the same time, material is loaded into the lower pump cylinder as the priming piston travels past the slot at the bottom of the pump. On the next upstroke, the upper ball check is closed, allowing the upper half of the grease to be pumped. At the same time, the grease loaded on the priming stroke is forced through the holes near the closed lower check, trapping grease between the foot valve packing retainer and lower ball check.